Hello, and welcome to the Reactor. All right, so this is Bazio Levin Stevens. Uh, I didn't even know this existed. Um, so Bazio, my favorite drummer of all time from Mr. Zappa, uh, Levin is the chapstick player. Chapstick. Chapman stick. <laughs> okay. And Stevie Stevens, also uh, best known as the guitarist for Billy Idol. Now, if you listen to Billy Idol, it's like there's guitars in Billy Idol. But he's got a great solo career, and I think he was just a phenomenal guitar player. Uh, he worked with Vince Neil when he went solo and did tons of other collaborations and other things. So he's one of my uh, favorite guitarists, um, but Bozio, man, he's he's the madman of drummers. And Levin, I think I think he's in the Liquid Tension Experiment, right? I do believe. I don't know for sure, but I do believe. He looks, that's Levin right there. I do believe. And that's Bozio. He looks so different. <laughs> he used to have blonde hair and crazy, and Mr. Stevens right there in the middle. All right. Well, let's. Uh, See what happens. Very Zappa like, yeah. Bass drum is deep. Keeping it cool. This is just, this is just three master musicians just having a lot of fun. Uh, the the sound of the bass drum is so airy. It's it's uh, just a classic Basio style. Ah man, this this kind of it has so many elements to this. It's like there's Zappa, there's Vi. They they were friends in the early 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 days. Um, and I think uh, I think Vi was. Uh, uh, was a student of Frank's, and now because you can kind of you can hear the the, the Zappa influence 
in, in his drumming style, but also in the guitar style too. So I don't know if Stevens had picked up some, some, uh, some, some Zappa, some Vi too. There's a little Vi vibe going on there too. Um, uh, beautiful stuff. Just God, so good. Mr. Levin just having some fun. had a knack for great guitar sounds just making this stuff I think he had a laser a toy laser gun at one point it sounded crazy Sounds so easy, but damn, that's amazing. He's got like six hands and four feet. Before that kicked in, there, there was a moment here of where the bass, uh, the bass line changed, and uh, there's something wild happening there. Let me go. Let me go back 30 seconds and see, figure out what the hell just happened. Nice little solo.
epic uh, rhythm change. It was very subtle, but so uh, dynamic, maybe? Is that the word? God. gorgeous so I gotta say for for the lover of sound of their instruments this is a great tune they really do some um, amazing work when it comes to the tone and quality of, of, of how this was recorded now that the bass sound was phenomenal that the, the drum tones that he was pulling off are just so uniquely Basio and and Stevens really just lets his heart just flow through that guitar and keeping his signature um his kind of style uh just this is a great band i don't know how this passed me by but you know here i am in maine and the word of music doesn't flow through uh, maine very well so it's just one of those things that just uh fell through the cracks but now i have a chance to listen to this phenomenal music that I have missed. Um, so if you know these guys and know where they're going, um, I'm pretty sure I haven't seen Stevie Stevens and doing anything uh, lately. Um, Bazio, I don't, I think he's done. I'm not a hundred percent sure, but I haven't seen him recently. He's getting up there, but Levin, I'm pretty sure he's still with the, the, uh, dream theater liquid tension experiment crowd. I'm still, I still think he's doing stuff, uh, but I don't know for sure. Um, but uh, amazing music, just the sound quality is amazing, and just a great groove, just a beautiful tune to just, I don't know, just crank up, you know, the outdoor stereo, wash a car or something, you know, just chill out and pick some weeds or something. It's just some great music to just chill out to. Alrighty, folks, well... There's that. Until the next time, cheerio.